Kello into the box, finds the back of the net. Yo, Rumits here and welcome to a FIFA 23 player review for 85 rated winter wildcards Noble Okello. He stands 6 foot 5 inches tall, he's massive, he's got high high work rates, he's preferred for his right and he's got a 4 star weak foot but only 2 star skill moves. His SBC is coming in at just over 18,000 coins so it is a cheap card but I mean he's from the MLS from Canada so he's going to be difficult to link unfortunately. He can play centre midfield and CDM as I said he plays for Toronto FC, plays in the MLS and has got the Canadian links. I've stuck a shadow on him which keeps him the lengthy accelerate type. His acceleration goes up to 86, sprint speed up to 95. His shooting, finishing low at 70 but shot power at 86, long shots at 80. If you happen to get a chance it might be alright. His passing, short passing good at 92 and long passing good as well at 91. Dribbling stats, agility and balance low 73 and 65 respectively. Reactions 80, meh. Ball control 87, dribbling 87, composure 83, that's not bad. His defending boosted with the shadow, inceptions up to 89, heading accuracy up to 95, defensive awareness up to 86, standing tackle up to 90 and sliding tackle up to 95. Physical stats, jumping 78, not bad, but he is 6 foot 5, his stamina 83, should last mm, until about the 80th minute. Strength 93, very strong, aggression at 75 average no traits at all i'm gonna be playing him at cdm in a 4-2-3 on arrow in this team as you can see i've had to use some mls players and heroes in here to get him on three chem but yeah let's see how he plays good acceleration oh almost finds the past past pass Nice pass. Good pass. Another one. Nice. Gets the assist there. Cahill puts it away. Nice pass through. His passing feels good. Another nice pass. Tackle there, knocks it back. Wins that back well. Oh, decent finesse effort. Corner kick. Oh, that was close. I think that was off the post. Good inception there, good positioning. Another inception there. Good pass. Good inception. Just taken off him by Kante. Good strength there, but Ronaldo got it back. Good nod on. Okay, hello. Oh, I can't finish it. That's a poor shot. If we could have intercepted that, can he out muscle Ronaldo? Yes, he can. Bit slow releasing the ball, but he did. Nice pass forward. Gets the assist. Good play. Good inception there. Okello driving towards the box. Oh, you know, I was in two minds there. I didn't really know what I was doing. Powerful runner though, half time. Good inception. Stuck to him that time. Not sure what the ball's about, but we've got it. Good inception, but lost out. Inception again, keeps it this time. Powerful. Can you set someone up? Ah, <laughs> swing and a miss. Just on the 85th minute and Akello is very tired. You'd be looking to substitute him right about now. <laughs> Look how big he is there. Oh my goodness. It was a lovely pass through. Ok, 
Keller into the box, finds the back of the net. He does have that instant acceleration that I like. Good tackle there, Keller. Pass through. Ah, keeper saves it. Should have gone across him. Good strength there. Can you create space? No, I just didn't have the agility there. Nice turn and pass. Lovely pass. Donovan in on the right. Lovely pass. Lovely pass through to Leo on the left. Nice acceleration. Just can't get past Carvalho. Good inception there. Oh, I thought I was going to get in there full time. So after three games with Akella, we got one goal, two assists, not a bad return at all from the CDM position and my opinion on the card. But before I give that quickly, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. But I greatly appreciate it. Thank you so much. How fast did I say that? But my opinion, yeah. There's a direct comparison with this one and it is Reese Oxford, the SBC that came out yesterday. Very similar, almost a carbon copy except for Reese Oxford has better passing, better shot power and better links. Obviously, he's English from the Bundesliga. Here we've got Canada and MLS. Quite hard to link unless you've got uh, one of the heroes from the MLS that, I mean, there have been plenty of hero SBCs. I'm sure you have one of them and you want to get them in your team. Here's a player you could try and link them with. Of course, there's the Bell card, the Cellini card now, the Pato card. So there are some good cards in the MLS you can link him to. But yeah, just going through the stats, the pace, coupled with him being lengthy and six foot five, he feels fast enough. He stretches those long legs and can get past players. So yeah, pace is good enough. Dribbling, he doesn't feel that great on the ball. He's not very agile. He's quite stiff when he's moving, a bit clumsy. So that's that's a, definitely a con of the card. The shooting, his shot power is quite low. I did get a goal with him, but I went in almost in slow motion. So yeah, I won't get in too many shooting situations with him. Passing feels great, actually. That is a definite plus of the card. His passing feels great. Defending and physical, I mean, he's just there. Um, he, he doesn't do too much that you that's out of the ordinary. So... Yeah, he's just there really, just sitting in front of the defence. If the ball comes really close to him, he'll intercept. But he's not doing anything outstanding in that sense. But, I mean, it's 18k, um, very cheap. If you really want an MLS card, here's your guy. But yeah, that's only my opinion. Please like, subscribe and comment if you appreciate it. Take care.